Hey everyone, welcome to Apogee Edge 4 minute videos for developers season 27 episode 2. In this episode, we are going to discuss about JWG token structure. Myself Anil Sagar, I work at Google and Apogee platform. Let's see how JSON web token look like. A JSON web token is set of characters that is divided into three parts. The first one is header that talks about the token type as well as the algorithm used. The second one is the payload which contains the information like climbs which are nothing but simple keys and values of a JSON object. For example, when the token will expire, context associated with the token like user ID. And the last one is the signature which is digitally signed encrypted information. The header and payload are base64 encoded. Most importantly, you have to remember it's encoded, not encrypted. And the last one is signed payload, which is encrypted using a secret. When you decode the base64 encoded header, you will see the result something like this. Similarly, when you decode the payload, you will see the payload contents. And the signature is actually encrypted and signed using a secret that a server keeps it as a secret and it can able to verify the JWT token whenever client presents it at a later point of time. How Apigee can help? Apigee can help you generate JWT token. Apigee can help you verify the JWT token that is coming from the client. Apigee can also decode the JWT token so that you can able to see the payload. And you can also use the JWT token as OAuth 2.0 token in Apigee Edge platform. To simplify the things, let's say you have enterprise backend and you have a client, Apigee Edge can sit in between your client and the backend system where you can able to create API proxies which will be exposed as APIs to the client. Let's say you expose the login API through Apigee Edge platform. Whenever a login request comes uh, to Apigee Edge, it will forward to the backend. And on the way back, if login is successful, the Apigee Edge can generate a JWT token and send the JWT token back to the client. Client can use this token to access an API like get me account information where Apigee can verify the token and forward the request to the backend, which will send back the response back to the client. Important things about JWT, it is used for authorization and information exchange using the digitally signed token, which is nothing but our JWT token. Payload is not encrypted. If, so, if someone got access to the JWT token, they can actually see the payload content. It is not encrypted, it is only encoded. You can able to verify the payload as well as the entire token using the secret. So it's not possible to tamper the token in transmit. If anybody tampers it, then the server knows it is tampered because when you decode the JWT token using the signed secret, it won't match. We're going to see in action how to generate a JWT token and verify the JWT token for your APIs in Apigee Edge very soon. If you have any questions, please feel free to post your questions in community.apigee.com. If you are evaluating Apigee Edge, you can reach out to us using this link. Please share this video with your friends and colleagues and help us spread the love for APIs. You can also subscribe to our YouTube channel so that you can get notified if any future videos.